of sexually assaulting more than a dozen teenage girls. And now, lawyers for 19-year-old Tyler Cost are pushing to get social media records from his accusers. ABC 15's Lauren Vargas reports from Pinal County Superior Court, where the teen's attorneys say he was set up. Tyler Cost's attorneys claim this entire ordeal was just a shocking conspiracy to put the teenager behind bars. And they pleaded with Judge White here at the courthouse to access some other social media accounts for alleged victims. Tyler Cost was in court today, but never said a word. The defense says they already have access to 98,000 pages of Facebook content, thanks to investigations by the Pinal County Sheriff's Office. Some of those messages by the accusers allegedly show the girls making plans to teach Tyler cost a lesson, just like the movie John Tucker Must Die, where ex girlfriends take revenge on a former boyfriend. Prosecutors would not comment on the ongoing case, but the defense attorneys say this is all about finding the truth. There were a group of girls who conspired against Tyler to put him in jail. They succeeded at that, and Tyler has been in jail for over a year based on those lies. When it was all said and done, the judge said he would take the issue under advisement. Both sides also asked the judge to push back that September trial date so they'd have enough time to interview all the witnesses. They're scheduled to be back in court on May 4th with a decision on that social media issue. Back to you. Well, Pinal County Attorney Lando Voiles uh, released this statement about today's hearing. Quote, in all cases, while defendants are presumed innocent until or unless proven guilty, the state prepares to proceed with all evidence, whether exculpatory or inculpatory. The state's responsibility requires justice be served by helping a jury to find the truth.